Cool Soul Simmers, my name is Darth Jaswick and welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to continue our One Tile Rags to Riches challenge and this is my sim Daphne Grove. She's just kind of chilling in her little apartment here. This is episode 5 of the One Tile challenge. Um, she's going to go try and clean up the garbage but I am not going to let her do that because we need that for our trash fruit. Um, we still have to just bake our pleasantly unpleasant waffles. Please don't pick it up, please don't pick it up, please don't pick it up. Please don't. No, 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 no! I'm moving them. I thought I had them far enough away, but apparently that wasn't... Whew, okay, that scared me. We'll just leave those there to rot. And I think for now we just need to make some more food. I don't know how much food we have in here. Yeah, we only have um, a couple of waffles and a few pieces of pizza left. Last time we figured out that the grand meals were really expensive, specifically the turkey meals, so we'll do that. Um, we'll do like a bunch of those. We can maybe then start building the apartments that I want to put above us just so we can earn a little bit of extra money. Um, I also want to switch to the market magnate aspiration. I would actually like to do this one too. Um, we have to run a food sale from two different lots, so we'll just go to like the bar next door because we're not technically leaving the area, but we've also got more than one tile now, so I feel like it's safe to let her go there. Thank you, football team sports day, for interrupting, but we'll put the food sale table in our inventory and then we'll head over to the bar for a second. We'll run one food sale there and then we might have to do another one from another lot. I'm not sure if it will count our lot because it's our home lot. I'm not sure if it will count us. Uh, travel to a different lot, place the food stand, and start a food sale. Do this two times. I have a feeling that we're going to have to travel to like an apartment in this neighborhood too just to get all of this done, but we will not leave this neighborhood. Even if we have to like go to the apartment, we can just like run down here, place the thing, and start a food sale really quick. We'll be fine because that's the only way we're going to be able to complete this aspiration. We've already convinced two customers, so we just need to convince three more customers to buy our food and then we have to travel to the two different lots. So not a lot, we don't have much to do for this one, for this part, anyway. Uh, we can throw this plate away, and it looks like we've got some nasty stuff here in our fridge. I wonder what it is, if it's like ingredients going bad? No, a citrus swig we'll make. We'll put that turkey in there, and then we'll just keep cooking a few more grand meals. I wonder how much the gourmet meals would go for. We could try to do one of those. I don't know if she has her gourmet cooking skill max already? I can't remember. Yeah, her gourmet cooking skill is maxed out, so I wonder what the most expensive thing is on that menu. Ambrosia would be the most expensive thing, but let's try to do a baked Alaska after she gets done with this. I would also like to work on her baking skill. She's only level two. Maybe the mixology skill too. We'll get her, we could get her like one of the glow bars and she can just mix drinks. Or the new bar from the Party Essentials kit. Ooh, I've called to inform you that your great, great, grand, second, once removed cousin's, cousin's friend's grandpa has passed away and for some reason has left a vast fortune specifically to you. Will you accept? I want to say no, but I also want to start building these apartments. And I also wanted Daphne to start dating somebody because she's always flirting with random people. I'm going to say money, money, give now. Uh, very well, however, now that you've accepted, I must inform you that you will only get this money if you become married within seven days. Those are the terms. Good luck and congratulations on the next chapter in your life. Okay. <laughs> Ooh, and now we have a tense moodlet from married for money, Try from trying to get inheritance money. Daphne accepted the offer of a giant inheritance over the phone, but now she only has seven days to get married to satisfy the hidden conditions of the reward. Why does this always seem to happen to her? We should invite, like, Penny over. We could plan a stay over, and then she'll be here all the time. We'll do six nights, starting now. Perfect. Are you ready to start the stay over now? This will end any currently running events, yes. Um, so she's not here, but our second turkey is done, so we'll just put that in the market table for now. I don't know how long it takes for Sims to normally show up. Oh, I guess I could put the walls down. I get so used to playing with the walls up, like in my uh, legacy challenge, I always play with the walls up because I like to film that way. Because I basically just do like updates with my legacy challenge instead of like a whole let's play like this. Okay, she keeps putting everything inside the decoration, so... Something smells bad, apparently. It's probably this counter. You can clean that. And clean out the spoiled food in here, I guess. I actually think I like her apartment being on the ground floor. And then we can just like build up from here. Have like an apartment 
like the stairwell be over here on this side where we don't really have any windows and then have the other apartments be like on top of us. Oh, and Penny's here. Hello. We should um, welcome Penny. Something crazy is going down at the ruins. No, thank you. Grime time from cleaning. Daphne's things may be a bit cleaner, but she's feeling a bit fried. We've woohooed with Penny, right? I feel like we did that in the last episode. We can do that again. That might help with your tenseness. Oh my. Oh, I forgot to unlock the doors. Unlock. We'll just unlock the door. That one's not. Woohoo with Penny, please. Okay, they're off. I feel like we could probably get married to Penny, like, very quickly because we already have a very good relationship. Now she's gonna go and make rice. Uh, Penny has followed us. Oh, and she's also making rice. Oh, she's cooking faux meat butter chicken. And now she's gonna make waffles right afterward. Oh my, what's she doing? Where are you going? Okay, thanks so much, Penny. Just clean that up, please. <laughs> oh, no, she's gonna finish it. Oh, they're cooking together, that's cool. So she did half of it and we're doing the other half, I guess. Well, let's release the steam vent on this rice that Penny made. Also, this like swatch <laughs> looks like cereal. Um, grab all those servings. I want to see what the quality is before I have her eat any. Because <laughs> she's got the refined palate quirk and I don't want her to be uncomfortable. Um, it's actually excellent quality. But it says it was made by us. But Penny started it. Can you resume that, please? Also, what's Penny up to? She's leaving. <gasps> no, she's going to go clean up my trash. I can't let that happen. <gasps> I need that, Penny. I'm going to put a big old box around it. <laughs> That way they can't touch it. <laughs> this is the only way that you can like get trash fruit is by leaving trash around. Now if I unpause this and she still picks up the trash, I'm gonna be very upset. <laughs> Penny no. Penny no. Thank you. Thank you. I need that. My garbage. Her needs are horrible. <laughs> Somebody pranked our toilet. I feel like we should um, maybe compliment her outfit. I feel like we should get our friendship bar up first because I'm not sure how she'll take her asking us to marry her if our friendship is this low. We can uh, talk about art. Um, maybe tell a joke about mimes. The bright side. Looks like Daphne just befriended an optimistic sim. Optimists have very glass half full view of life. They never fail to see pos the positive side of things and their perspective can inspire sims around them. In terms of Sims preferences, would you say that Daphne likes optimistic Sims? I would, yeah. She's a pretty positive person herself, so. We can also just like discuss color theory, ask about her hobbies and skills. I don't even think we really know her traits. Uh, I think that's in small talk. I get to know. She dislikes fitness. Humble brag, I didn't mean to click that. Uh, she's romantic. Can we ask her to join our household? Oh, she said yes. Oh, and they fixed the move-in thing. Sell all lot furnishings. I don't want your furniture, Penny. You live in a bad apartment. <laughs> oh, and now we have like 30,000 simoleons, so we could totally create like an apartment with Penny's old apartment stuff. <laughs> I guess I didn't really think about that. While we're like talking about getting together, maybe we could like ask her to be our girlfriend <laughs> there we go <laughs> they're girlfriends now okay penny you can also change into your everyday wear i could also give her a makeover i'm actually would be kind of interested in that this is like changing her outfits Ooh, don't scare her Ooh, maybe i should have penny propose it's there and we would gain fame from that I always feel like Penny should have been famous. Like, she could have easily come with, like, the Get Famous pack. Oh, wait, 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 hang on. That's, like, perfect. Okay, that looks like a good screenshot right there. For the thumbnail. Aw, very nice. Uh, new personality trait. Penny is feeling particularly loyal and committed to her friendships these days. Trust is important to her. Embrace the change. Yeah, sure. Daphne, now that you're a little bit better with moods, let's try to cook another gourmet meal and see like what the other like highest one is. Let's see how much this trout costs. I don't know if we did that the last time. Um, please resume that. 
Okay, so we have our trout done. I think I'm gonna send her off to sleep for a little while and like take a shower. After she wakes up, we can run the food stall from the bar next door. Oh, Penny, Penny, can you be a doll and repair that for me, please? Thank you. And also clean it, because it's disgusting. Oh, voting is now open. Penny has a few influence points, so we can probably vote for something. Uh, vote on neighborhood action plans. Oh, and I can bring her suitcase in here, too. We can just put it right there by the door. We'll do foodies. Because we're food people. Okay, Daphne is in a little bit of a better mood now. She slept for like two hours, so... We can always sleep when we get back from the other spot. We'll put that in our inventory. In our... In, in our inventory. Maybe we have to take our stuff off of it first. Put that in there. Can we put this in there? And this. And... There we go. I heard you got engaged. Congratulations. I'm so excited for you and Penny. Thanks, Bjorn. We'll get married tomorrow on New Year's Eve. I think that'll be fun. But let's wake up and go to the bar next door. We'll take Penny with us. Visit the karaoke bar with Penny Pizzazz. Okay, we are here at the bar. And our restaurant is right over there. Daphne is very excited to run her deli from this lot. We can put it right over here. It looks like it's covered in snow. Hopefully that doesn't break our waffle maker. Penny, why don't you cook some waffles? We can do the cured fish waffles. And we will start a food sale. And I'll have her try to convince customers to buy things. Uh, convince to buy uh, turkey dinner. Convince to buy turkey dinner. How much is the baked Alaska? $720? <gasps> Ooh, that is so good. Nice. I'm going to convince this customer to buy the baked Alaska. Oh. Oh, we have to wait? We can only do that once. Collect those waffles, Penny, please. I'm going to put these waffles from Penny in our inventory. And then have her start a pizza. Those Sims are so loud. I'm having Penny make a tikka masala. Oh my god. We're not doing that. <laughs> We're not doing the music. We can still kind of hear it. I hope I don't get copyrighted. But <laughs> are we not tending the table? Yes, we are. Okay, can we convince anybody else to buy yet? No. Oh, and there's paparazzi here because Brittany Cho is here. Oh, we can convince to buy baked Alaska. Oh, and she's just going inside. Okay, never mind. Um, oh. Oh no. Oh no. Why can't we convince them to buy anything? Where are you going? Why are you not tending the table anymore? Please, come back. Excuse you, Daphne. You don't just walk away. Okay, let's convince Lily Fang to buy the baked Alaska. Ooh, she bought it! Okay, there's a cooldown period for that, so we'll have to wait. There's also a sim playing the violin over there, so I'm just gonna stay over here. Um, this teen just spray painted this mural. I'm not sure how long the cooldown period is. Somebody else bought a baked Alaska. Okay, we can convince this sim to buy baked Alaska too. So we'll do that. And then we'll at least complete this part of the aspiration. <laughs> Maybe. If she... I don't think she did it. Nancy! Convinced to buy... Oh wait, she already has something in her hand. Convince the sim to buy the baked Alaska. I really want to get away from this bar. It's so loud. Oh, they bought it. And that part of the aspiration is complete. Okay. Let's end this food sale early. Mostly just because I want to get away from this bar. Okay, and then we'll travel. There's nobody living there. We'll just move somebody random in from our library. Uh, this sim can live here. And then we'll just travel to their house and um, start a food sale from their lot. Because technically it's a different lot. But we can always just do it down here on the sidewalk. Um, visit apartment with Penny. Maybe we could just start the food sale from right here in the lobby. Can we do that? We might not be able to. Um, which one is her apartment? I don't remember which one it is. Knock on door. Can we start a food sale from this person's apartment? Like, hello, I'm here. I'm just gonna... 
wait i saw one spot where where it would stay it's in the bedroom somewhere i just gotta find it oh i don't think she can get to that okay can we put it down here though i wonder if this will count i hope it will can we not put it down here this oh no we can't okay so we might have to travel to an actual home lot which is fine i guess We'll just, we won't leave San My Shoe now. How about that? Uh, oh, we could go to the Stargazer Lounge. That would be fun. Maybe we could just get married here tonight with Penny. We've got that. Let's start a food sale. That's all we have to do for that, so. We also have to earn $500 during a single food sale and sell a poor quality item for 100 simoleons. That might be pretty hard, uh, considering we've already got such a high baking scale. We might be able to do it with, like, we could probably get something low quality off the gallery if we really needed to, or we could always add another sim to our household. No, please tend your table. Why are you talking? Oh, she is. Okay, she's just talking. Agnes! Agnes. Yeah, you probably need that bubble blower, Agnes. It would probably make you less stressed out. Is this Agatha and Agnes? Yeah. Agnes, don't have such a sour look. Just try some of that bubble blower. I'm sure you'll be fine. Why is nobody coming to my food sale? I mean, I guess we don't have to start it here. If nothing is going to work, we can just clear this table and then go home. Because we already got that part of the aspiration. We don't have to do it all at once. Um, stop. Perfect. Let's go home. Oh, we should probably put this in our inventory first. <laughs> I had an idea while I was waiting for the loading screen. Um, we could have Penny cook a low quality meal because I don't think she has the gourmet cooking skill. Uh, she also doesn't have the baking skill, so we could try that, but they're exhausted. So I'm going to have them both sleep because I don't want them passing out. I also have to put the selling table back in here and I had to alt place it, so that's going to take me a second. But for now, I can just put everything back in it. We'll just put it in here, and then I'll put all the food in it. Can you get around that, Penny? Did that surprise you? Oh, you're just going to walk right through it. That doesn't even phase you. You phase through it. Whoa. Is there a pizza in there? Oh, wait. You're supposed to be over here. Excuse me. Ma'am. Can you grab this pizza? And then you need to go to sleep. Okay, so our market table is back where it needs to be. They're both in bed, and I will see you guys in the morning. Oh, my. There's all these workers just kind of standing around here. They're supposed to be over at the Spice Festival over here. Oh my, that's a lot of spicy stuff. Spice Festival Contest Curry. They're all supposed to be over here at the vending area. There we go. They were just like piled in front of my house. And now there's more. Oh, okay. Daphne is awake. She is about to pee her pants, so she's on the toilet. What is she very sad about? Drifting love? Caught the love of her life flirting with another. Are they joking around or losing interest? You're fine. Um, you want to just like sleep for a little while longer? We only have five days. Ooh, our trash is starting to leak stuff. It's like bubbling. That's disgusting. Ew. It shouldn't be long for our trash fruit then. At least I'm hoping it's not long. <laughs> she can harvest all the sage too. Okay. You need to shower. And then I'm going to have her try to cook a grand meal or no a gourmet meal she hasn't done anything with the gourmet cooking skill yeah we'll just have her do this lactose free yogurt fruit parfait and see if that's low quality if not then i don't know <laughs> the available leftovers don't match daphne's food preferences what does she have in there oh it's all like ingredients so we don't have any extra <laughs> lots of garlic uh, we should cook a gourmet meal for ourselves. Have something nice, you know? We could do these, like, Monte Cristo sandwiches for the house. But she's going to go harvest all that sage first. Penny, how did your yogurt turn out? It's normal. That doesn't help us, Penny. What level is she now? Still level one. Maybe she has to be in a bad mood. I mean, we're in a bad mood. Maybe we could do the baking instead. <gasps> that took me way too long to find oatmeal cookies. I mean, we're not in the greatest mood. She's happy, but her hunger is low. We're also level three of the baking skill now. Grab all the servings of the rice. And then maybe I'll have her try to do another gourmet meal or some kind of just regular meal. To see if what quality it is. Um, let's do the boiling frog hot pot. 
Um, and then we can put our faux meat butter chicken in the fridge just so we have a few leftovers for ourselves. These are excellent quality cookies, so we can just keep those too. We need poor quality stuff, Penny. And if I really have to, I'll just make a new sim and add it to their household for a minute and then have them make food. Yeah, this, they just all have too high cooking skills, so I don't think that's going to work. I said I would have them get married on night on the town. Mm, I think I'm going to run a food sale and then we'll get married after we're done. That sounds nice. I'm really excited for our trash fruit. Look at all the flies and the ooze coming from off our garbage. Hi, Penny. Do you want to work on something? Can you like scrap this painting and like work on your painting skill or something? We need a lot of money. <laughs> We're gonna build an apartment building on top of this building. So we need bucos and bucos of money. So do a flirty painting, that'll be nice. We just need to make $500 at a single food sale, which should only be like, we can convince our Sim to buy baked Alaska and that'll complete that aspiration for us. Oh, and the Sim that I just placed down in the apartment is here. Oh, how much did we earn at the food sale when we were at the uh, bar? I don't even remember. Uh, 1,600 from four turkey dinners, 384 from saffron waffles, 2,880 from baked Alaska, and 208 from a pizza. Not too bad. Okay, I also have to adjust this because I don't want to decorate. We can get in the party spirit and make resolutions, but I don't want to do the countdown to midnight. We can add baking as a and then gray and meal because that's just stuff that we need to do anyway so we'll just get like happy from it what is wrong here why did that why was that red yikes Baco john caught daphne cheating on him oh well <laughs> i didn't even know that him and i were in an actual relationship with that a new personality trait penny was cheated on by someone she cared for and is in a jealous rage. How could she ever trust again? Embrace the change. Jealous. I'm gonna say no, because I don't like that one. They were just, oh, he was our boyfriend. I thought that they weren't. I'll have to break up with him. Where is he? See here? No, we'll have to break up. Also, the werewolf is just like scarfing down her food. If you couldn't hear that. Bako is already here. Hey. Uh, break up. <laughs> so glad that you could make it here on this fine day, Baco, but hate to break it to you, but we're done. Sorry. Yeah. Flirty spouse. Oh, and now please don't get mad at us. She flirts with everybody. Let's talk about marriage. I think it's time to end this food sale so that we can work some things out. Uh, we made 4,040 simoleons from that, so that's pretty good. Can all of these sims go away, please? Oh, and we have a free baked Alaska. Can you all leave? Why can't I ask anybody to leave anymore? Oh, we're very embarrassed. Caught with another. Okay. I think now is probably the time to just elope. Um, that way Penny will be less mad at us. Unless that's not going to work. We might need to apologize. <laughs> um, I don't even know how to do that. Try to calm down express our admiration we'll talk about marriage okay she's happy now oh no let's elope please please i need you penny <gasps> oh that's from bakojang okay we're just getting married in the kitchen here <laughs> i swear i didn't mean to have her flirt with other sims she just does that autonomously all the time don't be nervous penny it's fine everything is fine there we go yay Oh my god. You satisfied the conditions, and now we have 45,000 simoleons. Awesome. And it also said that we were having our first kiss. They've kissed before. Uh, don't know what that was about. But we are married now, so let's uh, cook a grand meal for our spouse. Like, just like one of the ham dinners. We don't have to go all fancy with the turkey dinner. Are you okay, Daphne? I just heard you cheated on Baco. That doesn't sound like you. I'm speechless. <laughs> Bjorn, get out of here. That is 100% Daphne, though. You can go to sleep, Penny, if you want to. Oh, actually, wait, maybe not. Let's, um, let's call the grand meals just so you can get your holiday reward thing. I also put the ham in the selling table because we're not going to eat all of it. Our radio was broken, so we'll have to fix that. I just want to replace it. We have enough money now. 
It's only 88 simoleons, so we'll finish New Year's Eve in the next episode. Okay, so really quick before I end this episode, I just wanted to show you guys the apartments that we built. So this is our little stairwell here. We have this lower part where our mailboxes are. I left her apartment down here. I thought that that was for the best. Uh, we've got like a small picnic area for our uh, tenants. We've got two um, studio apartments here. Uh, one that's like kind of pink and blue and then the other ones that's like purple and blue and a little bit of pink. Uh, this one has a futon double bed so we could probably get two people in here and then one person in this apartment over here. But that is all for this episode of the One Tile Challenge featuring the market table from the Home Chef Hustle Pack. I will see you guys all in the next episode. Thank you all for watching. Um, I try to post a few videos a week, so subscribe and hit the bell button to get a notification every time I post a new video. I hope you all have an amazing day and I will see you all in the next episode. Dag dag!